Mr. Wilton, you testify yesterday that you're a member, you were a member of STL, is that correct? Yes, ma'am. And when you were a member of STL, were you shot at? Yes, ma'am. So I'd like to discuss some of those incidents. First, do you know someone named Jakira Barnes? Yes, ma'am. Who is Jakira Barnes? Jakira Barnes is my little sister. When you say sister, is she related to you by blood? Yeah, my daddy daughter. It's my sister. That's my mud sister, my blood sister. I'm sorry, I didn't hear that last answer. Daddy daughter, is that? Yeah. Sir, I'm sorry. Can I just remind you, please speak into the microphone directly so everyone can hear? Okay, yeah. Can you repeat your last answer? I say, yeah, that's my sister. Yes, that's my sister. And you said your sister. Did you say your daddy's daughter? Yeah, one of them. I like to show you Mr. Wilton. What's been admitted as Government Exhibit 574. Can we please publish this to the jury, Your Honor, as well? Yes. Thank you. Mr. Wilton, on the screen in front of you, do you see a photo? Yeah. Yes, ma'am. Who is that? That's my little sister. I'm going to show you what's been admitted as Government Exhibit 568. Who's in this photo, Mr. Wilton? That's me and Jakira Barnes. Can you point or which side you can touch your screen? Just circle it and make a mark. Can you circle yourself in this photo? So you've made a yellow circle or half circle on the left side of the screen. Is that correct? Yes. Yes. And is that person you? Yes, ma'am. And is the other person you said, is that Jakira Barnes? Yes, ma'am. And how old are you in this photograph? Uh, maybe about like 18, 19. Was Kyra or Jakira a member of a gang? Yeah. What gang? We was STL, EBT. You said STL, EBT? Yeah. Is that correct? Yeah. So, talked about STL yesterday, right? What's EBT? Same thing. It's three-letter gangbang. You said the same thing. Is that the same thing as STL? Yeah. Yes, ma'am. What does EBT stand for? Eberhardt. It's an abbreviation for Eberhardt. And what's Eberhardt? It's a block. Eberhardt's a block? Yeah. It's a street. Is that a block where EBT, STL, gang hung out? It's our block. It's Eberhardt. It's a block we hang out on. It's a block we live at. Eberhardt. And we being STL, EBT? Yeah. Is Jakira alive today, Mr. Wilton? No, ma'am. What day did she die? April 11th, 2014. How did she die? She was shot and killed. Were you there when she was shot and killed? Yeah, I was shot too. You said you were present for the shooting. Yeah, I got shot too. And you got shot too? Yeah. I'm going to ask you a few questions about her death, okay? Where were you at the time of the shooting? We was on Eberhardt. Can we unpublish, Your Honor? Yes. I'm sorry, Mr. Walton. You said you were on Eberhardt at the time of the shooting? Yeah. And it's Eberhardt in the city of Chicago? Yeah, 63rd. I was on 64th and Eberhardt. Yeah. So you say you were on 64th and Eberhardt. Yeah. And that's in Chicago? Yeah. 
And were you, what was on 64th and Eberhard? Were you at a house? Were you on a block? We was on a block. And who was with you at the time of the shooting? Me, Jakira, a female, Krishan. You said you, Jakira, a female, and Krishan. Is that correct? Yeah. And do you know the name of this female? Jasmine? Jasmine? Jasmine or Jasmine? Jasmine with a D. Jasmine. I think it's Jasmine. Jasmine with a D. Yeah, Jasmine. And did you have an understanding of who did she know in that group? That was Kyra Friend. And you said Krishan, is that correct? Yeah. And where were you standing at the time of the shooting? In the middle of the block? Middle of the block? Where was Jakira standing? On a porch? On a porch? A porch of a house? Yeah. And what about her female friend? Was the female friend there as well? No, she was standing by me on a road by the gate. The female friend was standing by you, by the gate. Yeah. And is that the gate of the house you were talking about? No, I was actually on the next, I was at the next porch. Okay. She was on that porch. I was downstairs in front of the gate. So you were, when you say downstairs, do you mean down the steps of the porch? Yeah, they down on the front step, the front porch steps. Okay, and while you were standing there, did you see someone approach? He had to hit the corner with a hoodie on. The person hit the corner? Yeah. Is that what you said? Yeah. And do you mean they approached the corner? Walked right over there. Well, yeah, hit the corner, approached the corner. I mean, it's really like the same thing, but yeah. I just want to make sure I understand. So the person approached the corner with the hoodie on. Did you see their face? Slightly. Mr. Walton, you testified before a grand jury in this case, correct? Yeah, I believe so. And your testimony was on March 22nd, 2023, right? I don't recall... Would showing you a copy of your grand jury transcript help you recall the date of your testimony? I, I guess, but yeah. Your Honor, may I approach? Yes. Judge, we'll agree it was March 22nd of 22. 23, I believe. 22? 23, actually. 23? Mine says 22. We can have a quick sidebar on this if you like. Turn to the next page, Steve. Turn to the next page, Steve. The cover page says 22. Yeah, but everything else, oh, okay, 23, that's fine, okay. So, Mr. Walton, would you agree with me that March 22nd, 2023 was the day that you testified in a grand jury? I guess, yeah. Earlier this year? Yeah. And when you testified... You raised your right hand and you swore to tell the truth, didn't you? Yeah. Did you tell the truth in the grand jury? Yeah. You told the truth, Your Honor. I mean, it's like at this point, like Vaughn did it. So it's like, ain't no need to lie. He did. He can't go to jail. I can't dig him up and charge him. So what's the point of lying? I'm going to ask you a specific question about your testimony in the grand jury. And for the parties, I'm on page 33 of the transcript, which is marked as Government Exhibit 8009. Judge, can we have a sidebar? Mr. Walton. Yes, ma'am. When you testified in a grand jury, were you asked, did you get a good look at the person? Yeah. Who did it? You say, did it? And did you answer, yes, sir? Yeah. So I think you just said Vaughn did it. Yeah. 
So did you recognize the person who came on that corner as Vaughn? Not at the moment. Not not right away. Bro, I had to look. When did you recognize him? Shit. When I hit the floor? Did you say shit when I hit the floor? Yeah. Do you mean the ground? Yeah, when I hit the ground. Bro, when I hit the floor, when I got hit, I looked up from there. Oh, okay. And when you say hit, what do you mean? I got shot in my leg. Who shot you in your leg? Vaughn. And do you know, is Vaughn a nickname? Yeah, I mean, that's his real name, right? Vaughn? What's his full name? Do you know Vaughn's full name? Just know him by Vaughn. I'm going to show you what's been admitted as Government Exhibit 50, sorry, 536, excuse me. This is admitted Government Exhibit 536. Your Honor, may we publish as this has been admitted? Yes. Do you recognize the person on that screen, Mr. Walton? Yeah, that's Vaughn. That's Vaughn? Yep, that's, yeah. Is that the person who shot you in the leg? Yeah. Yeah. And, Your Honor, I also like to publish what's been admitted as Government Exhibit 537. If I could do that, Your Honor? Yes. I'm now showing you has been admitted as Government Exhibit 537. Do you recognize this person? That's Vaughn. That's also Vaughn? Uh-huh. And so you said that Vaughn shot you in the leg. I want to break that down. So you said Vaughn was on the corner, a person approaching the corner, and then what happened next? Shit. He got to shooting. Did you say we got to shoot in? No, I say he got to shoot in. He got to shooting. So was he shooting as he was coming towards you? Yeah, he was shooting once he hit the corner, hit me in the leg. What did you do after he hit you in the leg? Shit, I crawled through the gangway. You say you crawled in the gangway? Yeah. And can you explain to a jury what a gangway is, if they're not familiar? It's the side of the house, the gangway of the house. So you were crawling to the side of the house? Yeah. And while you were crawling to the side of the house, did you hear any gunfire? Yeah, I already heard a few. There was like nine shots, ten shots, something like that. Was that nine or ten shots that you heard, you said? Yeah, like nine, ten, I don't know. Somewhere, I don't know. Multiple shots? Yeah. At any point, did you look back at the area where the shooting was coming from? Only looked back when I fell. Once I got to scooting myself through the gangway, I wasn't worried about nothing else but getting away. And did you see Vaughn shoot anyone else? I was already through the gangway. I want to go back to your grand jury testimony. When you were in the grand jury in March of 2023, you were under oath. You testified about this shooting. Is that correct? Yeah. And I'm going to ask you, did you see Vaughn shoot Kyra? Page number, please. Page 31, beginning at line 11. Specific reference is page, begins at page 32. Line 23 for counsel. Did you see Vaughn shoot Kyra? You say, did I see Vaughn shoot Kyra? Yes. No. Your Honor, may I approach the witness? Yes. Thank you. Mr. Wilson, I'm showing you what's been marked as Government Exhibit 8009, beginning on page 31. I want you to focus on line 13 with the question, what happened? Where he was? When you were in the grand jury and testifying under oath. Mr. Walton, I'll read the question out to you and the answer. You have that in front of you as well. I thought you said read. Were you asked question? What happened? 
And did you answer? Well, we would stop by. We would stop by the police first, and then when the police let us go, like five minutes that went past, and um, Vaughn hit. Vaughn had hit the corner. Vaughn had come around the corner with his. He had come around the corner with his, with his hood up. He was trying to pull his hoodie up when he hit the corner, and I was standing right there by the gate, and I looked up, and when I looked over at him, I saw who it was. I took off running. So when I started running, he started shooting at me, and he had hit me in my. He had hit me in my in my knee, which had tore my ACL, tore up my knee, my knee bone up in places. And when I had fell, I said my knee bone up into ten places. Mister Bolton, let me finish the answer, and then I can ask you about it. And you continue to answer. And um, when I had fell, he had he had tried to run up and step over me. And amidst him trying to run up and stand over me, my sister and her friend, Krishan and Tyler, they were sitting on the porch. When they were trying to get into the house, who porch they on? It was our friend porch, but our friend mama didn't want to open the door for them because they were shooting outside. So she closed her door and locked them outside. And Devon, well, King Vaughn, he had... He had shot my sister twice. He had shot her in, like, he had shot her in her face first, and she fell on the stairs because she was trying to run down the stairs and run into the side of the house. So when he shot her in the face, she fell down the steps to the step, and King Vaughn had run up the porch. He stood over her, and he shot her nine more times after that, repeatedly. Then the question was, did you see that? And the answer was, yes, sir. Is that what you testified in a grand jury, Mr. Walton? Yeah, that is what I said. And is that statement true? That is what I said. Did you see that? Yes, sir. Is that statement true? Did you see that? Yes, sir. I did say yes, sir. Did you see Vaughn shoot Kyra? I was in a gangway. I was like this. So you're testifying today that you did not see Vaughn shoot Kyra. I was in a gangway like this. My legs was out of the gangway. Kyra and them was on the porch on the side of me. What you think I saw? I'm asking you, Mr. Walton. You testified in grand jury that you... I don't know. It's really... It's a touchy situation for me, bro. You know? I really like... I really don't like talk about my sister and that nigga Vaughn, like period, point blank. That's why I really got an attitude sitting up here. Like, I really don't like talking about this man, bro. My motherfucking sister dead, bro. I tell you. And I understand you don't like talking about it, Mr. Walton, but you're under oath today and you need to answer the question. I am answering. So you said yes. You testified that in the grand jury. I did. I repeat again, I did. I just said yes. So I repeat again, yes. And is that true what you said in the grand jury? Yeah. Thank you.